So on Boxing Day, um, just gone, it was about, say, four o'clock in the morning. I was in my bed, I was sleeping because I was flat. <laughs> and I heard a crash. Um, so I wanted to look outside. I heard all this shouting and commotion. I wanted to look outside. So I look outside my window and there's this like young black guy who looks like in his, I don't know, late teens, early 20s. And then this young white girl that looks the same age. So he's shouting, how could you do this to me? You always do this to me. She's like, I'm sorry. And he's like, no, every year you do this. So he's trying to get past her, like, nye, nye, get out of my way. Nye. And then she's like, no, stay here and talk to me forever. So he's he's angry. He can't get past her. Imagine I'm, I'm good at animating. He can't get past her. And then out of frustration, he just turns, goes, walks in my car, and it just punches my car. Just punches. One punch. He punched off my wing mirror. And then he was still punching my car. So he's really doing it. He's getting into it. He's like, mm, 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 mashing up my car. So then I shut out my window. I'm like, hey, why are you punching my car? Don't punch my car, please. Bear in mind, I'm in my house. I'm looking out the window. So he turns, he's like, <laughs> Shut up! I'll kill you! So I was like, ah! And I went back inside. I wasn't outside, but you know what I mean. And I thought, for fuck's sake, you're upset with her. So, you know, don't hit her, but just leave. There's the road there, you can walk around her, you can push past her. She's not strong enough to stop you. But because she was like, no, stay here and talk to me. I'm so sorry for what I do every year. He's threatening to kill me. I'm mashing my car still. So, I looked at Logan, and I was like, Logan, we're gonna have to mess up this guy. We're gonna have to mess him up. And I can't fight, and I'm smaller. <laughs> and weaker than him, so I thought, oh, we're gonna have to break out this dojo. What weapons have we got? I was getting all of these. Do you know what I mean? I was thinking, ah, oh, ah, but I thought, oh, I can't kill the guy over the wing mirror. So, instead, I called the police and I said, this guy is outside my house messing up my car now. They were saying, why would he do that? And I said, because he had an argument with his girlfriend. He's frustrated. So instead of punching her, which is what he looks like he wants to do, he punched my car and I have nothing to do with it. The police were like, stay in your home, please, ma'am. We'll come, we'll handle this. Bear in mind, the guy's still outside chatting rubbish, screaming and shouting. So I'm vexed. So I'm on the phone talking to the police. They said they're going to come soon. The signal's really bad. So we had to go into a different room to call the police. And then by the time we got back there, he wasn't there anymore. Well, they weren't there anymore. And I called the police back and I said, are you not going to be here soon? Because he's just walked off. And I'm like, oh no, we're not coming. He's probably gone by now. He's probably gone by now. And I thought, you lot tricked me. <laughs> because you knew I was going out there to defend my property that I paid for for five years. Anyway. So now my car window is messed up. <laughs> the end.